Okay, so I'm going to show you my Samsung Galaxy S2. It's running ICS, the ICS ROM, the Resurrection version 1.1 Pro. It's based on a new firmware. It's a newer firmware past XXLPQ, which Samsung released. But first, I'm going to I'm going to show you the quadrant and stuff. And see, show you how fast it is. But what I want to show you is uh, the boot screen and how fast it does to restart. Like the HTC, this phone does not have a fast boot option. Okay, just gotta wait a bit here. And there it goes. I just wanna show you the boot screen and how fast it does. The triangle means it's rooted. Okay, now we're back on. So what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna quickly optimize the phone just so we can get like the best results here for Quadrant. Yeah, that's done. So clear a bunch of RAM, close some apps. So we're gonna go back. Yeah. yeah let's go here, optimize. Now I'm gonna show you quadrant right away. It's the newer quadrant, the February release, so it works for ice cream sandwich still showing one core so it's wrong I don't know why it does that Okay, now we're gonna try quadrant. <clears throat> we're gonna try quadrant again. Yeah, there. Now it's correct. See two cores. XXL7. Okay. I'm just gonna go back and show you the I wanna show you.
I just want to show you the base band, the kernel, and all that. Now we're going to go back into quadrant, and then I'm going to... What would you like to do? Nothing. Get lost. Um, now I'm going to go back into quadrant and show you guys. So two cores enabled. Now I'm going to run the full benchmark. Now we're now we're gonna proceed. Let me see the results. Let's focus here. So I got four thousand seventy-eight. Um, I have gotten over forty-one hundred. It just depends, really. This ROM, I've never seen it below thirty-nine. So that's that's what I get for CPU and memory and stuff. Yeah, thanks for watching.